make a YouTube video. Such is life. So guys, today we are going to be doing a playing card inspired characters. Which was one of the suggestions I gave in my video I also uploaded today. You choose my YouTube video today. Technically, the suggestion I got was a completely new one called Making a Jacob Arts Card Game. But I cannot do that, so I took the closest thing, which was one of my own suggestions, and I thought would be really cool for you guys, playing card-inspired characters. Now, I have four cards I picked out from a deck. It's a really old deck. My brother got it at some after-school camp. But it's still a good deck. I only used face cards, um, so I'm going to have to narrow it down real quick from a queen of spades, an ace of spades, a king of clubs, or a jack of clubs. Um, I feel like a queen of spades would be the best way to go. And just to clarify, this, this, this thing right here, that picture, is not the inspiration for this. Playing cards themselves, the symbols, are the inspiration, and what I think of as a queen. Um, a queen of spades. So, we'll be doing that. This might take a bit because um, my editing software is glitching so much that the glitches are glitching and my music thing isn't working. So uh, there's no music for the time lapse. I know I can't add my own personal voiceovers because that's glitching. So I'm sorry that I, this video might never exist if you're watching this footage. But it might. Uh, so here is my playing card inspired character. This is the Queen of Spades. As you can see, I wasn't lying when I said it would be more inspired by playing cards themselves than the faces. Uh, I did give them checkerboard feet just because it's a game, like playing cards are. Both games. So, anyways, um. This is my queen of spades. I think it looks pretty good. The supplies I use for this are a purple brush pen, using this opposite not brush side. This pink glowy thingy that's this color. Um, black outliner. Gray, which I realized I forgot to use, so the sword is just gonna be white. And a pencil. So, the pencil was eventually erased, as you've, you'll learn more about the technique I'm using in the Lancer Speed Sketch video. Ooh, that drawing still gives me nightmares. And all credit, speaking of Lancer, goes to Toby Fox and the original designer that Toby Fox uh, used for this playing card inspired thing, because... I've been watching a lot of stuff on Deltarune, Toby Fox's other game, apart from Undertale, which I have covered on the channel many times. And the playing card heads is all their idea. I mean, you can't copyright ideas, but I thought I would give a little credit. But, this is my playing card inspired character. Anyway, hope you enjoyed. Bye-bye.